This place is buzzing. Good. <clears throat> I have never gone into any showing with this much confidence. I hear the press is going crazy out there. Can't wait to find out what this big secret's all about. That's just a few more minutes. Where's Brooke? I don't know. Or find her. She has to announce the new fabric at the top of the show. No, Margot will do the opening, and she won't be mentioning Brooke's new formula. Marissa, take this for me. Put on that record. Dad, what about the press? How are they going to understand what the impact of what they're seeing? I have it all under control. Brooke should be making that introduction, though. Ridge, it's taken care of. Wondering where you've been. Waiting for you. Aren't you out there? Maybe later. If you don't, someone else is going to announce your new fabric. I talked to Eric, and he said he would handle the announcement. Why, Dad? Ridge, I just think I should stay in the background. This is your chance to show people who you are, what you've accomplished. You can't pass that up. <sighs> Wouldn't that be something? To have people recognize my name and my face? So why don't you get up on that stage and show people who you are? Because there's something that means a lot more to me than fame. You. And I don't think it's very wise to stand next to Eric when I'm about to file for a divorce. You'd make that kind of sacrifice for me. you give up all that. I'd do anything for you. How could I know? Wouldn't it be perfect, Rich? Wouldn't that just make everything so perfect? Sorry if I interrupted something with you and Dad. Oh, that's all right. He was just commenting on how I looked. Oh, that's great. You've been looking dynamite these days, you know that? Well, thanks. It's been a long time since he's noticed me in that way. Well, it's about time he did. Because you're very attractive in so many ways. You always have been. You always are in the eyes of your children, aren't you? No, in the eyes of a man. You think that I'm uh, being unreasonable? Hoping that uh, your father might still harbor some feelings for me? You kidding, Mother? That's not unreasonable at all. I'm so very proud of you for doing this for yourself. Well, I'm not just doing it for myself. I want so much to have another chance with you. I want him just to see me for what I believe I am. A vital and alive woman who's just so much in love with him. Be made. but there is someone else who should be getting the credit for this discovery. And I think I see here in the back of the auditorium right there, if you'll just excuse me for a moment. Eric, please. Brooke, 
they want you. Oh, really? Come on. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the very talented chemist who created this incredible, stunning achievement. This is the woman who is responsible for this fabric breakthrough. Now, she is very modest about what she has done. But as far as I'm concerned, from this moment forward, she's the most important woman in our industry. From this day forward, throughout the world, she will be known as the First Lady of Fashion. May I present to you Brooke Logan Forrester. <laughs>